Uh, your wife, why did you want to something to say? Just a couple of words. First of all, I just wanted to thank everyone for coming. Now that I'm not going to vomit, I can talk. <laughs> and we would like to thank our parents for hosting our grids. And we'd like to thank our Aunt Naomi for hosting us here. And we have to give an honorable mention to Josh, who's the glue, who puts this whole event together. So I don't know where you are, Josh, but he's hiding over there. Um, as some of you may know, for us to have a second child has been a little bit of a challenge, and we're so blessed. And, sorry, a little overwhelmed. And the fact that it's a boy, I mean, I know we've got a daddy's girl over here, but so blessed to have a boy and have a complete family. I can promise you I will not be pregnant again. <laughs> As the rabbi mentioned, this outfit is really special to my family, and it goes back to 1969. And without, except for my two dear, dear nephews who are at summer camp, everyone who has worn this outfit is here, from Israel, from California, from New Jersey, <laughs> and now we got New York City, so it's really, really special. So Rex will be the 10th member on his maternal family side wearing it. Uh, I just want to mention also our grandmother Muriel couldn't make it today. She's our, our living grandmother and she is not healthy enough to come up to Florida. So for all of you who know her, please call her and just tell her every detail you can and send her a picture and it would mean so much to me because, you know, it was, it was a little hard she couldn't make it. And finally, the name. Um, I lost my grandparents when I was young, and I had one grandfather who lived till when I was 18, and his name was Leo, and he's really special to me. And I always knew I wanted to name a kid after Leo, and when Allie was born, she would have been Leo, but I wanted to use the name and not just a letter, so I'm so blessed that he's Rex Leo. And a little bit about my grandfather. Just a minute, please. First of all... Some of you might know I have a little secret dirty addiction to General Hospital, and I'm going to blame my grandfather because I used to watch As the World Turns with him. He was addicted to that too, so I think it's genetic. I'm not a drug addict, I don't drink, I don't smoke, I have a little bit of General Hospital addiction. And um, another thing that I fondly remember is playing war with him, and he endured like hours of hours of card playing with me, and it's prepared us to play with this sweet little angel, Allie, because she loves war. And finally, the only reason I know how to drive and my father and I still have a relationship is because <laughs> we used to drive every Sunday for me to practice driving to go visit my grandpa Leo. And as a special treat, I used to get McDonald's. And those, those of you who know me, I'm a real junk food junkie. So not only did I get to drive and visit my grandfather, but I used to get McDonald's, and that was like a special treat. So I just hope he's looking down and knowing that his namesake is carrying on. He would have been 110 if he was here. So... Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for coming. Eat up, there's plenty of food. Joshi's okay. going to make a mozi over the challah, so no one eat before he One does that. One second before the chalice, go ahead. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so we know the reason why we gave him the name Levi after... Ben, stop. Sport.